film festivals are awesome, they're great, but this provides mass exposure instead of limited exposure. Now if I'm on the other end of that and I love to go to independent film festivals, I might be able to go to my local one, but I don't get to go to a lot of them. There's going to be a lot of films I don't get to see. The Audience Awards provides me a place to see all of those great films that didn't get on television or I don't really know how to find them in Netflix or YouTube or on Vimeo, for example, or Hulu, because there's just no, there's no way to like, there's no great curator of content right now for the independent filmmaker. And I feel like that's a need that the Audience Awards is addressing for the independent filmmaker. So from my perspective, this is kind of like Kickstarter after the film is made. Like the film has been made, it's done the festival route, now what? How can I reach thousands and thousands of people? As we all know, a billion people turn into YouTube every day, but they're not gonna turn into Paige Williams' channel. But if they have a channel like theaudienceawards.com that provides mass exposure, then all of a sudden my film gets to be seen by tens of thousands of people. Then we're gonna have user profile pages where you get to curate content for your friends. So you can say, here's the 10 funniest videos on YouTube. Here's the 10 best films on the Audience Awards. Um, it's a lazy Sunday afternoon. Here's what I suggest you watch. So we're building, it's like a entertainment social media platform where you get to curate content for your friends. But in terms of short films, that, there's a ton of short films being created that are amazing. And there really isn't a great place to put them. And so we feel that need too for the independent filmmaker who's making short flicks.